You ever hear Miles the Cricket play the banjo down the old rusty bedpan? Hey, what's up everybody? It's Gristle back again for another music video reaction, this time to Newest's Face. Um, I did action a long time ago. Unfortunately, it's not on my channel anymore uh, for reasons. But um, I've gotten a lot of requests from way back for this. Uh, I finally did some catching up and I'm finally able to do it right now. So, um, so yeah, let's do this. Newest's Face, here we go. I'm excited. Now that I know Ren's a dude. <laughs> oh. This is the second song ever I've heard from Newest. It's Bach. Is that Baco? He's got like a pink line in his hair. <laughs> is that how he's pronounced it Baco? Oh, that's, that's Minhyun. Minhyun. There he is. There's Ren. Looking all luxurious. <laughs> that's Aaron. Isn't it? I'm pretty sure that's Aaron. I like this. I like the grittiness of how the school looks. That was kind of bad. Oh, JR. There we go. I like JR. He's my dude. But, is it JR or Junior? I call him JR. I don't know. I call him JR. <laughs> Pushing Ren down. Hey, look at Ren, man. He's just cool. Even though he he really likes dressing feminine, I don't mind it. I think he's cool. I used to mix up uh, Minion and uh, Aaron all the time. Because they sort of have similar hair, in a way. Oh shoot, breakdown. JR up front. Breaking it down. Oh, that's a epic shot right there. Man, this fight choreography though is kind of... I mean, I like the song and I like the video and the grittiness of it, but man, the fight choreography is terrible. Yeah. This is crazy. It is like a gritty ass school, man. JR, man. I like him, dude. He's cool. newest face. I really I really enjoyed that that was a good a good music video starting right away with like I really dug all the outfit design they had in here like it was uh, a cross between well first of all I really like the what was it would be considered like the uh, school dress you know code or whatever you want to call it it kind of looked like a I don't know cross between militant I don't know it looked militant to me that's what it looked like but then when they got into like dancing and stuff 
uh, got into the choreo and everything. I really liked how they had they had like the uh, kind of dressed up look, but it was all out of out of whack. They had kind of just urban. They had they had just all kinds all in one scene, but it was all in the same colors. They had black and pink and like grays. And that really popped. It really was cool. It really, I really liked how that kind of meshed together. Like, and there wasn't too much pink. It was just Ren and Jr. had uh, pink pants and pink gloves on. Ren was rocking the most pink, but hey, everyone expects that. So, but um, to go along, it, the the outfit design really went well with the sets. The sets were freaking amazing. Like, I kind of in my mind, I said it as like. It was kind of very inner city-ish with mixed, meshed with like the age of like Hogwarts has. You know, even though it don't have, it didn't have like epic statues and carvings and everything like that. You know, like in the deep halls of like Hogwarts and stuff, how old and aged it looks because it is. Well, it looked, it meshed what, like it looked like this. It looked this looked very aged but had the look of an inner city so it was a mesh of inner like an inner city hogwarts if you could think if, if you can imagine what i'm trying to explain here it just kind of looked i don't know it just it just really looked cool i like the setting of how that was and the setting like set up tons of like epic shots in the video like the part where they're just sitting there in front of that huge blackboard with all that all the like newest stuff written all over it that was really cool because if they didn't have that blackboard you'd lose track of where you were like in the fight scene i mean you wouldn't but i can see what they were trying to do there they wanted to make sure you knew you were in a school because even though the group was sitting there like all epically posed and stuff you had people fighting in front of them and it, if it did that blackboard wasn't there it would have just been like a dark room they could have been like in a factory somewhere it wouldn't have mattered but because that big huge blackboard it reminds you hey we're in a school and you had that crazy i don't know what the mask meant that the teacher was wearing but it was uh that that blackboard that was up there was was cool placement of just an image that reminded you where you were so um but <clears throat> with all that there's the epic shots of those and then there's the dance that one of my favorite scenes in here with the dance choreography is when they take everything out and it's just the group and it's like that dusty dirt floor and they were sitting there uh really just breaking it down that's that scene where jr the breakdown happens and like jr is up front that those were like awesome fight scenes or not fight scenes those are all <laughs> I was, getting, I was getting ahead of myself. Those are awesome dance scenes. Now, the one thing I didn't like in this video was the terrible, terrible, bad fight choreography. Like, the fight choreography in here was horrible. Like, maybe if they weren't going in slow-mo, it wouldn't have looked so bad. But, like, the kids, when they were, like, throwing punches each, at each other, the kids' heads were, like, moving before the punch even got there. Either that or they, they should have filmed it from a different angle. You know, knowing how filming works, if they would have just tweaked the camera just slightly, that punch would have looked like it was landing. And then also, when uh, there was one scene, I remember who it was now, going through the group. He was sitting there throwing punches at, at everybody. And he was like, he was like two, three feet away from them. Especially when he got to the last one, I was like, did they really need to put that in there? That was bad. But overall, though, that was the only complaint I had with the whole music video was the, the bad fight scenes. The rest of it I thought was cool. You know how I am with dark imagery and kind of the epic kind of looks. And even though these weren't like huge epic, you know, vignettes or anything like that, the epicness of kind of just how aged it was and how gritty it was i really like that i like real gritty footage like that um the footage itself was crisp but the grittiness of the sets was awesome i really liked it so i hope you guys liked it let me know what you guys thought about this video when you first saw it and let me know what your favorite newest songs are down in the comments and as always if you guys have requests hit this request box over here 
right there with the dancing dude in it. And if you can't, if you're on your phone watching this and you can't hit that, there's a link down below in the comments to my request video. Let me know which songs you want uh, me to, to react to and I'll get to them as fast as I can. Also, as always, if you like this, please hit the like button over here and share right here because it helps this video out and helps me out a ton. So I love you guys and I will talk to you guys later. It's Bristle. Peace. Hey, was that something you enjoyed? I put some more videos here you might enjoy as well. Also, subscribe button up there if you haven't clicked that yet. Hope to see you soon.